Hi, I'm Ben from EasyFrame. Here's a tutorial on how to fit your artwork into an aluminium frame. By this stage, you should have had your artwork already prepared so that you can fit it into your frame. You will also need a small flathead screwdriver to slacken off the corner brackets to help release the spring clips in the back of your frame. You do need to remove at least one length of the moulding to gain access to the contents and you'll need to realign each corner after the artwork has been fitted. When you receive your aluminium frame, please do not be overly concerned if the corners are not correctly aligned as this problem will be resolved when you fit your artwork and realign the corners yourself. Your aluminium frame will be supplied with glazing, MDF backing, corner brackets and hanging fixtures. Looking at the back of your frame, you'll see a number of silver spring clips that should be partially fitted in the recess between the MDF board and the frame. The spring clips can be eased out of position using a screwdriver, but we recommend covering them with your other hand to prevent them springing out and causing injury. With the spring clips removed, you'll be able to slacken off two screws from the corner brackets of any of the lengths of moulding. You will only need to slacken off the screws slightly, not remove them completely. With two screws undone, you should be able to slide out one of the lengths of moulding to gain access to the contents. In this case, the glazing, if you've ordered a mount, and the backing board. Down below is a link to our website which details how best to clean your acrylic glazing to reduce the amount of static it will generate and minimise the chance of dust particles getting in between your acrylic glazing and artwork. If you are not familiar with using acrylic glazing, then I would recommend reading it before peeling off the film. The artwork should be placed between the acrylic and the MDF backing and then slide back into the recess of the aluminium moulding profile. Once in position, the length of moulding you removed earlier can be refitted with the two screws retightened. The spring clips can be put back into the frame recess. You should now check the artwork from the front to make sure that everything has been fitted correctly and free of dust particles. If you are happy, you should now check all the corners and adjust their alignment as required. The corners can be realigned by slacking off the two screws, holding the two lengths of moulding together so that the mitres are correctly aligned, and then retightening the screws. Our aluminium picture frames are supplied with hanging brackets that slip directly into the aluminium profile. One on each side about a third from the top and secured in position by tightening the screw. The supplied cord is then passed through the two brackets and tied securely. We hope you found this tutorial useful. Leave a like on the video and let us know how framing your artwork went into an aluminium frame in the comments below. Thank you for watching this tutorial by EasyFrame.